In this code sample we have the script element that refers to the jQuery library and over here we have simple input element with uh, the ID str. It is a simple text field because we have the type attribute assigned with uh, the value text. Here we have a simple div element with the ID changes. Now over here I invoke the dollar function coming from jQuery passing over a document meaning that we get an object that represents the entire document. On that object we invoke ready and pass over a specific function we want to be invoked when the document is loaded. That anonymous function includes this code and this code says that over here we want to get the object that represents the input element with the ID str. On that object we invoke the function change passing over the function we want to be invoked whenever uh, the value of uh, this specific text field changes. In other words, whenever the change event takes place. And here we specify the function we want to be invoked whenever the change event takes place. And what we want is having whatever is in between these uh, two div elements appended with a simple dot and the result to be assigned over here to this div element. So now when I check the outcome, you can see that if I type something and get out of the text field, I have a dot. Now if I continue, get out of the text field, another dot, etc. And this is the outcome of uh, this code.